morning to you. Welcome to the Wednesday Shave. Thank you again. She who must be obeyed. Many thanks, Mrs. H. Um, okay, doke. Okay. I'm trying to. Well, a new shaving oil today. This is just a. Um, where did I get this? Pound stretcher. Just a beard. It's a beard pro shave and be beard oil. So I'm using it as a pre shave. Don't need to use it as a pre shave, but it's. It's one way of using them up. Um, razor of choice. This thing. Uh, very popular in starter. People who are coming over to this way of shaving. Um, it's a very standard uh, aggression head. It's midway. Short. Uh, inexpensive what it is. A Merca 34C. Um, much the same as the Edwin Jagger. That's another good. Edwin Jagger DE89. That's another good starter razor. Good everyday razor, daily shaver. Two piece, long thread. And in that, we're gonna use, the, this is the number one, so it's a second use. It's a Gillette New Improved Stainless um, Super Thin Blade. I'll use one of them, place that on here. I'm gonna use a shaving cream I've not used for a while. There we go, there is a slight overhang to be aware of. And the shaving cream is Susie Banner for men's spearmint. Lovely, it's like um, Wrigley, 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 Wrigley's spearmint gum. Oh yeah, so that's that. I'm going to load the brush differently. Uh, we're going to use the Captain's Choice um, brush. A special one, lovely. I love the handle on this. It always covers a, like being in deep space. Tuxedo knot, uh, synthetic. Um, I'm going to gather dry. And twist. Just trying something different. And we'll go straight. I'm going to use the... Uh, there you go. Into this circle uh, of wet, wet this, and straight into the fine boulder. So, anyway. so it's a cleaner way if you want to, if you didn't want to touch the cream for any reason, uh, and your brush is dry. Obviously, if there's no wetness in the soap then the cream. Or you can just easier to gather it out and put it in a bowl. But just, you know, it's different. And... So, how's the week going? God, it does smell like chewing gum. How's the week going for you? All right. I'm feeling good health and good form. Uh, the, the winter's lasting here. It's, it's been wet and rather cold. Um, and we've also had a lovely day. Very windy, but sunny and cold. But uh, signs of spring. I noticed the farmers have put little jackets on all the baby lambs, it protects them. Um, they can cope with the cold weather, dry, but they can't cope with the cold, wet weather at that young age. And look at that, as we've been jibber-jabbering. Well, that's a perfect, um, perfect cream. So, put the lid back on Susie Banner. Good stuff. We'll wet the face. I've only got one towel today over there, so I have to use that. Because um, I've washed all the shaving towels in one go. So here we go. Ah, that's nice. Now there's no need to use a... I want to just dry the face. There's no need to use a pre-shave, but, you know, when we've got all these products and things, they're no good satin drawers, and plus when you're buying new, this is only inexpensive, so I can't help myself. So, two squirts, that's enough. There's a 
hint of coconut or something in there. Nice. So you could use this as a, if you've got a beard, you massage it in beard oil, or you can use it as a shaving oil. Some people use it. The trouble when you use these shaving oils to shave, you can't see where you've been, if you know what I mean. Unless you've got a, the growth where you can see it. Um, that's lovely, right. Yeah, having the shave today, you're partaking in this event. Right. Yeah, some lovely colours. All right, so we're ready to apply. Mint is lovely, isn't it? It's a nice fresh scent. I've got to be honest, I never thought I'd see the day where I'd be shaving with these scents. <laughs> so much choice, haven't we, these days? It's nice. Right, we'll heat up the Merca 34C. Any plans this week? Or is it a standard sort of working week for you? Well, whatever it is, I hope you're having a good week and you're in good health and things. It's very important, isn't it? Nice blade, that. Lots of whiskers. Now obviously the shaving oil has left a lovely layer there of um, protection, slickness. So it wouldn't be correct in saying very slick shaving cream yet, even though I know it's good stuff. And as you can see, it doesn't hamper the shave. Nothing sticky in this. It all helps if you have a... Well, firstly, if you're new to this way of shaving or you haven't done it for years and you're coming back to using a blade, it's different, isn't it? Some people can feel quite sore. Razor burn, you can... Your skin's very sensitive, so it's a good idea. Good preparation. Hot shower if you can first off. Warm water, um, pre-shave soap or pre-shave oil. The reason I use these, they're inexpensive. You know, you can pick them up, put a thin layer on, and hopefully you can see the proof is in the pudding, as they say, where... Uh, works you know just till you get used to your skin gets used to this way of shaving if that helps if you have sensitive skin but very light touch as well this is the people new you know coming into the rinse off them. So we have a lovely spearmint. Spearmint? Wait, could we, there's a new word, spearmint. Spearmint scent in the air. Fantastic. Drop of water. I've, um, later this morning, I'm meeting 
two Australians. Well, one's, well, yeah, one, sorry, no, he's really, he's, he's a South Walian one, born in South Wales, emigrated to Australia, lived well, many years, good, I'm sure it must be over 20 years there. So he sounds, you know, he's got the accents. So uh, and now he lives in London. So he's coming up to North Wales with his friend who's from Australia. He must have been friends when he lived there. And I'm going to give him a, a bit of a tour of the historical buildings and areas around here. Um, across the growth now. And we're going to have lunch together. The sad thing is Mrs. H is working, so she's... She's going to be my chauffeur. <laughs> well, you know, drop me off and uh, pick me up later. Nice phrase of this. Well balanced. Uh, then one of them's a YouTuber, uh, the other one I don't think is, but he watches YouTube. Um, but not shaving related, YouTube. Um, I know them more from my other channel, so I'll do a bit of a video with them. Gonna bring Skippy with him. Get eye, Skippy. Right. Lovely. Plenty more to do. There is good slickness in the cream. Get your nostrils around there. Beautiful, isn't it? You'd have to laugh when I first started doing that. Because I don't think many do it that, that's got sense. When I used to start, I used to say, go on, smell that. Beautiful, isn't it? And some people, <laughs> it's just a go towards the screen. You might think, well, how do you know that? It's because they told me. <laughs> Against the growth, really nice. The Gillette, super thin. Second use. It's a sort of a, as I say, a standard aggression, but it really feels comfortable, close, and as I say, you could use it safely every day. I think this, if you're a daily shaver, and most you know people do. I've seen in the comments over the years when I've used it, um, a lot have said I started out with this and it's now my daily shaver. And Yeah. 
Uh, the reason I was saying that uh, the winter is seems to be lingering is uh, been quite damp and cool. So hopefully in the next week or so, week or two, things will start to liven up. Oh, that's lovely. Wow. I've ordered, I'm taking the plunge. I've had a word with a, a professional gardener. I'm not sure if I said this, um, about chilies. Because I've had luck with them, and then some years I've not had luck. Uh, I've had these aphids or whatever they are, and they just come as they flower, and as the chilli starts to grow, it, they seem to attack it. Not all of them, but anyway, he's given me some special liquid. You can spray that on them, and uh, they will be no more. So it's a... Uh, that's good, you know what time it is now? Three, two, one. Pick up time, baby! Um, so that's good news and then I was watering them all wrong you told me what they like and so it's it's good really I'm glad I spoke to I should have spoke to him years ago I've seen him most days when he's uh, at his job They do greenhouses, they got a grapevine they do, and vegetables, flowers, everything. Yeah. Ah, it's a lovely sound there. Oh yeah, good stuff. Perfect. So we'll rinse off now cold water. Oh, the chili plants. Uh, God, that is cold. I've ordered them from a, a professional uh, website where a lady grows them. You can either buy the seeds, plugs, or plants. I've gone for the plants, so they're not ready till next month. Um, so I've got to, I'll get the special compost ready. Make sure there's good drainage, good pots, and then we'll take it from there. The one's called Armageddon, it's a hot chili, and the other one is a Trinidad Scorpion, something. Uh, they're in the super hot league, in the super hot. I like it. I like them hot. So we'll see how they grow. But the way I look at it now, I don't, um, even though I've had this knowledge, I don't look at it as a, we're going to use Boots, the Chemist, Tea Tree and Witch Hazel. Use this as a, if they grow, they grow. If they don't, they don't. And then uh, there's not too much disappointment then. <laughs> nice and clean, sort of. Get a feeling you've almost been disinfected, lovely. So that's the very happy with that. And then I thought I'd go with some ake, uh, eau de cologne, lemon eau de cologne spray formers. Oh, that's nice. Lemon, we've got spearmint, we've got lemons going on. <laughs> And then some of this, and I used this for a while. The uh, Real Shaving Company 
post shave soothing balm lotion uh and it goes into another language so yeah keeping your face comfortable all day so we'll use a bit of that as i gotta oh this is ready there we go I forgot how good that is because I've um, I used to have their shaving cream that used to be good stuff and that's it I shall leave you in peace so we've used the Merca 34C uh, the Gillette super thin second use perfect captain's choice synthetic brush and um, the fine lather bowl we've used susie banner spearmint cream we gathered with a dry brush just to be different it worked and um we've got all the uh pre-shave wasn't it this unity it's called I got it from pound stretcher uh shave oil but i used as a pre-shave we've used tea tree boots of chemist tea tree and witch hazel ake or akai eau de cologne lemon eau de cologne and then the Real Shaving Company uh, Soothing Post Shave Balm. Lovely. Really happy with that. Midweek shave. Ready to meet the Aussies now and take them out to lunch. So all the best. Have a great day. Great rest of the week. And I'll see you on Sunday for the weekend shave. All the best. And bye-bye.